Fairy Godmother haul video, take one. <laughs> so, we'll just show you by Katie May. It's the clapperboard. And it comes in this lovely box from the Walt Disney Studios Park. And it costs $19.99. You can write on it with chalk, whatever you want. That's just a bit of fun. I used it for the All Around Dreams vlog that we made in the park last weekend. And of course, I'll be using it for Fairy Godmother because we're so professional. We have to go Hollywood style. So first of all, in the last haul video, I showed you these little tins of sweets. These are one euro. Look, Castle Castle. And I couldn't open it basically, but I'm gonna show you the little trick now. So you press really hard in the middle of the tin and voila, it opens. It's as simple as that. And then when you wanna close the tin, you just press around the edges and it closes again. So now you know, these are one euro at the checkouts and they're really easy to open and close, but I just could not work it out last time. So last time I showed you that I got this vanity set in the Hotel New York and it had in it a springy thing that I didn't know what it was. Well, it turns out it's a shower cap. You turn it inside out, you turn the paper inside out, and shower cap. Don't wear it over your ears in the shower. That was just to demonstrate. So yeah, if you get a vanity set, it has a weird springy thing in it, and you want to look like a school dinner lady, it's a shower cap. So just on the theme of toiletries, these are the toiletries that you get at the Hotel Cheyenne. You get some shampoo, you get some conditioner, and they have Woody and Jesse on them, Toy Story, and you get the little soap. And they will replace the soap and these in your room every day. They're quite generous. And there's also a big bottle of shower gel on the wall by the bath. So they're quite fun to collect. If you're staying at the hotels now, they all have toiletries themed to the hotel. So another thing I bought was this Fantasia China Bowl. It's from the Ink and Paint series, and I got it in Walt Disney Studios in the shop there in Studio One. And this was $12.99, and it's a fairly big bowl, you can see. But it's really nice china with gold all around it lovely decorations. So yeah, I just bought that on impulse because I thought it was really nice. And I have some of the ink and paint uh, plates that match it as well. This is a lanyard that I bought. It's released in October, I think. It's the It's a Small World lanyard. It's really nice. It's in the Mary Blair style. She's the Imagineer who designed all the little pictures and little models for It's a Small World. So it says there, It's a Small World. It's got some of the dolls on it. And of course it says Disneyland Paris on it as well. So they are 9.99 the lanyards. And that one's lovely because it's from It's a Small World. And there was a series of pins to go with it, which I showed you one of the pins in the last haul. I only managed to get one. <laughs> You can get these sweets from all the shops in Disney. Um, they have the fizzy he Mickey heads and then the non-fizzy Mickey heads and they're 4 99 That's right. Yum, yum, yum. 4 99 euros and this is what they look like out of the packet. So you can see there's a green one, a red one, a yellow one and they're just white on the other side and well, I think we should try one. <laughs> Let's try one. Very nice. They're like Haribo <laughs> kind of, cute. but you can only get these Mickey head shaped ones at Disneyland Paris. They definitely sell them in Candy Boardwalk Palace, but other shops as well. <laughs> so while we're talking about snacks, this is a tin I got. It says Disneyland Paris on it. It's got obviously the Eiffel Tower. It's got the Sleeping Beauty Castle on it, some of the characters. And this tin was $12.99 and it's full of butter biscuits. 
And on the butter biscuits are the characters which Katie's going to show us now. We think there's six, so hold them up quite oh, close. There you go. There so is, this is Donald. Donald, of course. And Daisy. Daisy. Mickey. Mickey. Pluto. Pluto. <laughs> Minnie. Minnie. <laughs> and Goofy. Goofy. Whoa. We're dropping the biscuits. We're obviously going to eat the biscuits anyway, but the tin is really nice. It says Disneyland Paris on it. So the tin's a really nice souvenir as well. It won't take us too long to eat these biscuits. They're quite frail. They break quite easily, but um, that's a nice present to bring to somebody, I think, because it has all the characters on it. So €12.99. So this is the fudge you can buy. They're blocks of fudge in Candy Boardwalk Palace. These are three euros 20 for a block. They're actually bigger than these, but we've already cut some off and eaten it. That is a lemon flavor block, a vanilla flavor block, a cookies and cream flavor block. Mm. And my favorite, raspberry, or as they say in French, framboise, fudge flavor, and in Candy Boardwalk Palace, which is the shop with the pink canopy on Main Street, you can buy one block for €3.20 or buy three, get one free. So it's obviously the law that you have to buy four of them. Whoops, I just dropped it. <laughs> because why would you only buy two or three when you can get one free? So that's the fudge and I think it's essential that you try this. You can't really say you've been to Disneyland Paris and done the snacks unless you try this fudge. and. The raspberry one's fairly new, really nice. So bring some of that home, it lasts ages too. Well, it lasts ages if you don't eat it really quickly. <laughs> okay, I really like these. It's like a scarf, but it's a neck warmer. It has on Disneyland Paris, and it's like a tube shape sort of a scarf. And I'll just try that on for you to show you how it works. This is what it looks like. It's just really cozy, made of fleece material, says Disneyland Paris. So this will be the thing to keep you warm in the winter and you can carry it around in your bag, put it on in the evening maybe when it's cold. And that's 13 euros 99. Just to show you this Disneyland Paris shopping bag, you buy these instead of plastic bags now. This is a medium size one, it's two euros 50. It's obviously got on it Disneyland Paris, the castle, some fireworks. And on the other side, the Earful Tower, Mickey, It's a Small World, and Space Mountain. So those are really nice and they last ages. And this medium sized one is 250. So this shopping bag is from the Mary Blair collection at Shop Disney. So Shop Disney Online. And Mary Blair is the Imagineer who designed It's a Small World and she's got some murals as well at the Contemporary Hotel and things like that in Walt Disney World. So this is her style and there's a whole range of china and things at Shop Disney UK and this is the bag you get if you spend over 30 euros so I thought I'd just show that to you. Shop Disney. This is the new Christmas spirit jersey. It's different to the old spirit jersey. I'll show you the old one in a minute. It says on it Joyeux Noel with Mickey here. And it's got the tartan and the lovely red and green Christmassy. It's 60 euros. I'm just going to turn around and show you the back, which is amazing. So this is the back and it says on it Disneyland Paris, which is really nice. And I don't know if Katie can say, but each letter has something different on it. Like pick out some of the letters. Does it have like toys on it or something? So you've got your Christmas bauble. You've got, I think, a gingerbread cookie. Um, a Christmas tree and a candy cane. Yeah. yeah, so these are really lovely and I'm going to show you last year's one as well. So this is the new Christmas bobble hat. It obviously says Disneyland Paris on the front. It says ho 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 with little Mickeys for the O. I don't know if it's any different at the back. I don't Ooh. think it's too different at the back. It matches the spirit jersey really well and this new bobble hat is 19.99. So, yeah, I think it's pretty cool. And when it's cold in the parks at Christmas, this will be just what you need. So Katie's demonstrating the old spirit jersey, which has on, instead of, see this is new spirit jersey, has Joyeux Noel. And Katie's spirit jersey, the old one, 
has on it Mickey Mouse in his sand hat. This is actually my spirit jersey, it's XL. That's why it's massive on her. So if you turn around at the back, Katie will show you. It says, Merry Christmas. This is the spirit jersey from two years ago. And the new spirit jersey obviously says Disneyland Paris. And the tartan is also different. I don't know if you could hold up a bit of tartan and show that it's got little Mickey heads in the tartan. Whereas the tartan on the new spirit jersey, it's just played in tartan. So if you've got like the new spirit jersey or the old spirit jersey, they're both really nice, but they have these differences. So of course, naturally, I've got to have both of them. But I like the fact that this one says Disneyland Paris and Joyeux Noël because it makes it more special to our parks. Whereas this one could be for any parks because it just says Merry Christmas. 60 euros. So of course I had to buy some ears. You can come in the shot if you want, Katie. <laughs> These ears are Pluto ears, of course. There's Pluto's ears and they're yellow like Pluto. And on the ears are these little reindeer horns. But even better than that, there's a switch at the back little switch here that you just put on and ho 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 merry christmas you've got flashing christmas light ears what could be better than that you can be pluto you can be pluto as a reindeer you can be flashing christmas lights so i'm all set for christmas season with these and they are 20 euros so this is a new hoodie. It's a white sort of cream colour, I would say. It's a Christmas hoodie from Shop Disney. So Shop Disney UK, you can go online and get this. It has a Christmas Mickey here and the lovely tartan sort of strings here and tartan inside the hood. And best of all, on the back of the hoodie, you've got a big like Christmas Mickey and it's all embroidered really nicely. So yeah, on the back, you've got this lovely embroidered Christmas Santa Mickey. This is £48 from Shop Disney UK. It just literally arrived in the post this morning and I really like it. I'm going to be taking this to Disneyland Paris for Christmas season. It's nice and cosy and warm as well. So yeah, if you want that, £48. I bought a few pins on this trip. I bought this set of Christmas pins where you have Mickey, you have Pluto with his ears on, same as my ears. You've got Figaro, the lovely little black and white cat in a present. And of course you've got Minnie. So that set of four pins you can buy in most of the shops at Disneyland Paris. It's not limited. They're 20 pounds. And then Katie's gonna show you the other pin that I got. So this is another Christmas pin and it's just a Mickey head with a Santa hat. And that's orange, so that's seven euros 99. There you go. Zoom it in a bit on the camera, Katie. Exactly. We'll show all the pins. All the Christmas pins. Ho, ho, get ho. Get collecting. <laughs> yeah, get collecting. Woo. <laughs> I bought this fridge magnet. It's a Christmas fridge magnet. And it was five euros. And of course, it's got stitch on it and the cute little ducklings. It says Disneyland Paris. But one thing I noticed about this fridge magnet is that these letters like D in a bauble, E in a gingerbread biscuit, Y in another bauble. It's exactly the same as the back of the Christmas spirit jersey. So it's for this season. So Katie's going to show you the Christmas spirit jersey again. Okay, so and I'll show you this. See? Same letters. It's Disneyland Paris Snap. <laughs> Merry Christmas. I bought one Christmas bauble, which is this one. It's like half a sort of bauble dome. It's got in obviously mini dress for Christmas, a lovely lamppost. It's got um, Figaro the cat with a little present. It says Joyeux Noël, which of course means Happy Christmas in French. There it is even closer. And if I turn it around, you can see that it also says Joyeux Noël on the back of it and Disneyland Paris. So that is a great souvenir or a great gift you can bring back from the parks with you. And that one was €12.99, but there are hundreds of Christmas decorations. It's really hard to choose one, but I do like the ones that say Disneyland Paris on them. So that's why I chose this one. This is the final thing I'm going to show. It is a Disneyland Paris advent calendar. And again, it says Joyeux Noël. It's got the Christmas tree and all the characters, Disneyland Paris, and it opens out like a book. 
And inside the book, you've got this amazing Christmas scene with Mickey on a sledge, Chippendale snowboarding, Minnie and Daisy making a snowman, and all the little numbers are here. And as you know, you shouldn't open advent calendars until December. So December the 1st, you're going to open number one. December the 2nd, you're going to open number two, and so on, until Christmas Eve, December 24th, and it's Christmas. But um, I'm thinking of opening this number one door now, just to show you all what's inside. But actually, it's only October the 22nd today. So I'm thinking, should I do it? about it okay so kids never do what auntie liz is about to do now you should wait until december the first but here is door number one and inside you have got a little packet and inside the packet we've got can you hold this for me katie we have got a sweetie now what are in these sweeties and is this advent calendar actually worth like 20 euros 16 with annual cost discount let's see there you go it's a kind of nutty chocolatey chocolate nut thing i'm gonna hold it up to the camera so if you're allergic to nuts don't buy this advent calendar but if you like nuts that's what's inside every door bye everyone happy early christmas So, so, oh God, so I really like these things. It's a neck warmer. It's obviously. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> okay, start again. So here we have the sweets from Shop Disney. <laughs> no. <laughs>